he knew fine well he was barred. He still tried to get into the premises. He told a little lie that he had a conversation with me. And I was, I, I, fair enough, I let him in the club, but it was unwittingly that I let him in the club. He didn't tell me I was banned till Christmas. I only got to tell it was a year till Halloween. So, I think that was a lie. They entered the club under false pretenses and weren't entitled to the benefit of any prize that the club was offering. Is yes. that about right? That's... Have I put it in decent legal terms that you're satisfied with? Sounds good to me. Well, you weren't told you would get back in at Halloween. But I showed the ID when I came yeah. down at Halloween, and nobody said anything. And I was talking to you. I, I, I didn't even know it was you. That's what I'm trying to say. Fortunately for you, you didn't advertise that event. So therefore, Kieran, you had no sense that you were even going to enter a competition. So to that end, your case is dismissed. I think he's definitely tried to intend to hoodwink the club, to hoodwink my security and myself, and that's why I decided to revoke the prize. I feel the decision's wrong because uh, I wasn't banned from the Lorenzo's, so, or the nightclub, whatever, and uh, so I feel I should have got the money. Kieran's, Kieran's a good lad, he um, does get himself into a bit of trouble, but if he behaves, he's more than welcome back to the club.